Hello artists! Today we are going to create a patterned kitty. This is our kitty right here and you can see that we've only used black and gray crayons. And we've created a lot of neat patterns in here by repeating shapes and stripes and circles and things. So we're going to get started. Move that out of the way. We're going to need a clean piece of paper and a black crayon. Make sure you put your name on it. I'll do mine right here in the corner. Okay, now don't worry, if you make a mistake, you can flip your paper over and do it on the back, but we're gonna do our very best today. Yours might look a little different than mine because we're two different people and that's okay. Now I'm gonna do the face first. I'm gonna do this circle right here. I'm gonna do it about this big. I can use my finger to do a practice circle. And then when I feel good about that, I can draw with my crayon. So I have that circle in there. We can do some almond shaped eyes. Circles. I'm going to put the nose and the cute little cheek circles in. the nose, the mouth, little cheek circles, a cheerful little kitty, and then I can do the ears, and those are just upside down V's, and then some up upside down U's inside of the ears, just like that. Now yours probably looks different than mine, that's okay. I'm going to put four little U's right here along the top, and if you don't want to do four, if you want to do three, if you want to do five, you get to do however many you want. That's the neat thing about art, is they all end up looking differently. Now I'm going to put in the feet, and I want to try and make them about the same size. So I'm going to bring a line down right here, and do like that. Bring my line down, I've just done right here. I go over for the foot, and then a U, an upside down U, over again. And this one's gonna be a big U, right there. And then over again for the other paw, upside down U, over again for the other paw. And then I can come right here and do a big upside down U. Or I can come this way. I think I'm going to come this way. Like that. Okay. Now I'll put the tail in. I'm going to start right here and go up like that. So I can just kind of eyeball it with my finger. Plan out where I want my line to be. And see, this one doesn't look exactly like that one. That's okay. Each one is going to be different. Now I'm going to put those lines in on the tail. Okay. And then I can start putting all of these lines in on my kitty. I'm going to start by doing these big U's right there. And I'll do those big U's right here. I think U is this kitty's favorite letter. Okay. And then I have these going lots of different directions. So you can do big chunks and little chunks. Do one right there like that and one like this. Okay, there's my kitty cat. Take a minute to get your kitty cat all ready to go for the next step. Move that off to the side. I'm going to bring this one back so you can see here. 
Now I've been using mostly black crayon, but I can get my gray crayon out now. And if you remember from last week, we did some um, value scale bunnies. And when we were practicing with our light, medium, and dark grays and blacks, we experimented on pushing 